Hello, this is Rakesh Rao from Design Sense Software Technologies. In this video, I am going to show you how you can use CAD Power to change the start point of a polyline. For example, this polyline, I can do a p-edit and you can see that this is the start point and it progresses in this direction. Now, let us say for some reason I want to change the start point to here. So with CAD Power, it's quite easy. So just go to cat power polyline tools vertex management and there is a command here called specify a new start point for closed polylines so I click on that i click the polyline and then now i must specify a new start point so i'm going to specify this as the start point so you can see that there is a red mark here and you can see again using p edit that the start point has been changed. So in this manner you can change the start point and position it wherever you want. So for example I want the start point to be between these two arcs so I just click here and p edit so the start point is changed. You must bear in mind that this command changes the handle of the polyline so applications relying on the handle must make note of this but any X data or object data that is attached to the polyline is carried forward. The process of changing the start point of a polyline requires that the polyline be recreated and that is the reason the handle gets changed. So this is uh, quite useful in many applications when you want to uh, ensure that the start point is at a specific place so that all measurements or labeling can be done from that point. So the command works identically in BricsCAD as well and is available under the polyline tools under vertex management and it's called specify new start point. If you wish to run it from the command line, you can just start the command here called cp underscore new start, select a polyline and the command runs from the command line as well. Thank you.